Hey guys, it's the loud guys. Today it's time for Family Guy and we are reacting to best of Herbert and Chris. So Herbert, we know Herbert is a perverted guy and the thing is like he has a different fetish. He has a fetish for small <laughs> kids and that too like boys, small boys. So he's also after Chris and now we'll see what he does after going for Chris. And the thing is like we have seen him going after all the other kids and he tries, he tries all the other things just to get those guys near him. And what he will do to Chris, I cannot even imagine. The thing is even Peter is a very stupid guy. So I don't expect him to like intervene and stop his style from being abused. I think so only person that can help them is Brian or Stewie only because they are the only two thinkers of that family. Now what will happen between Chris and Herbert? It will be very, very interesting to watch. Seriously, I'm so much excited to watch this video because it's been a long time that I haven't seen a video of Family Guy. So that's the reason I'm so much, uh, I'm having so much curiosity to watch this video. And yeah, I have seen a Herbert video before this one, but uh, literally I didn't get that one. But I hope uh, in this video, I will get every joke because uh, as I'm watching Family Guy more and more, I'm getting their jokes and most importantly, I'm enjoying Family Guy. Earlier, I was not a big fan of Family Guy, but yeah, after uh, watching it, I'm becoming fan. And for me, the most favorite character of mine are uh, Brian and Stewie. Stewie. But uh, maybe <laughs> Herbert is going to be my favorite one. I don't know. I don't have that much idea. So yeah, let's watch the video. Yeah, it will be very exciting and very fun to watch. So let's watch this video. Hi, I ran away from home. Do you mind nice. if I live with you? Live with me? My goodness, I feel like I'm gonna pinch myself to see this if I'm This kind of guy doesn't exist in India. <laughs> Hot dog, it's for real. <laughs> oh, my God. That old man was so scary. Mr. Herbert, it's six o'clock. I'm, I'm not really tired yet. Well, you have those three cups of NyQuil. You'll be down soon enough. Okay, good night, Mr. Herbert. Sweet dreams, Chris. Why is Chris sleeping with this guy, man? Seriously, why? Oh, I Mr. Know. Herbert, oh. what's life really all about? Well, I suppose it's about trying new things. Sampling the sweet and the savory. Not being afraid to take everything life wants to throw up on oh. you. Wow, oh. I never looked at it like that before. Thanks, Mr. Herbert. Okay, now you gonna switch on the light Wait, again? Don't you think yes, it's scary I don't to try new things. Oh, his no, bed is getting closer. Like see, a new baseball glove. Oh. At first, you think you're never gonna get a ball in there, but then you oil it up, work your fingers around in there a little, and pretty soon you're pitching and catching. I guess that makes sense. Oh no no no! Yuck. Sorry. You really know how to waste a sea hour. <laughs> Oh, finally. Chris, what did you do with my videotapes? I had a whole system. I was trying to find a good movie to watch. I've never even heard of most of these. Jeffrey at the Park, Mikey's Scoliosis Exam, oh. Nephew Somersault Compilation. Well, even if you never heard of them, I assume you heard of the alphabet. You want to explain to me how Sammy Popsicle comes before napping various? Geez, I'm sorry. Well, can we watch Lost Boys? I've heard of that one. Those? Those are different Lost Boys. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, he's ridiculous, Herbert. Oh, hey there, young fella. Bringing me good news today? What? Come on over here, son. Hand me the paper so I don't need to use my grabber. Mmm. That's a nice muscly throwing arm you got there. Uh, thanks. Oh. Got a nice tip for you right here in my pocket. For my arthritis. Why don't you reach in there and fish it out for yourself? Oh, oh that's okay, mister. I don't collect till the end of the month. I'll see you tomorrow. Weird. Weird. <laughs> <laughs> hey, muscly arm. Why the long face? Oh, it's this girl. I can't talk to her. It's like girls are a different species or something. Oh, oh who needs them? It's not like you that. like popsicles? Well, sure. Popsicles. Then you need to come on down to the cellar. I got a whole freezer full of popsicles. Mm. Oh my no god. No thanks. I gotta get going. Oh, don't make me beg now. <laughs> You're funny. Bye. Chris is so get dumb. Your fat ass back here. <laughs> Home. You have 113 new messages. Wow. 
Oh, my. Uh, yeah, I was just wondering, uh, mm, well, where the newspaper boy was. <coughs> Haven't seen the newspaper in a couple days. Wondering if you ever gonna come back. <coughs> Guess who? Sorry to leave you so many messages. Oh, my God. This here, thinking about the muscle on paper boy. Wishing he'd come by and bring me some good news. Well, oh. oh, you're starting to piss me off, you little piglet son of a bitch. Go. <laughs> this is the Hi, Mr. Herbert. Oh, my God. Children, run. It's that pervert. Everybody into my safety basement. Oh, oh, that was a bad snap. I'm hurt, kids. Don't eat those popsicles till I get down there. Oh, my God. And they what told the him to stay away from the wolf, but he didn't listen to them because he's his own man. And he knew that sometimes the things that seem the most dangerous turn out to be the most fun. Yes, sir, it was a good day for young Peter. Oh, no. My God, I don't like him. He's such don't a sleep, weirdo. Please, don't sleep. Oh. Are you a pedophile? <laughs> he is. <laughs> What the heck? I don't know what we're afraid of. Nothing would change if we made love. So I'll be your friend. Wow. And I'll be. Well, I'm all done shoveling your walk, Mr. Herbert. Thanks, Chris, but there's some in here, too. What the heck? I wish that scary-looking clown at the end of my bed would go away. McDonald's? Hey, skinny britches! That there's my man. Why don't you pick on someone your own size? Superhero that the world needs. Go away, Mr. Herbert. It's not me. I'm in your closet. <laughs> oh. Hey, Christopher. What you up to? Hi, Mr. Herbert. My dad's helping me find a hobby. Well, you sure got a pretty morning for it. Chris, don't waste our time with the elderly. They're dying. <laughs> They're yeah, dying. They are dying. <laughs> Please, God, let me just sniff his hat. Let me just sniff his hat. That's all I want. Oh my god. Now I want more. Oh uh, Chris, no. Seeing a young person like you enjoy puppetry makes me so happy. I feel like we could become good friends. That sounds like fun. Wow, I think you're just about my most favorite guy who's going to die soon. <laughs> That's the nicest thing anyone has ever said to me. Oh no! Oh no! Alright children, your mammy and pappy asked me to look after you for the next couple days. So Why? I'm gonna lay down a few ground rules. No cussing, clean your plates, and only a half hour of radio and then it's off to bed. Well that sucks. And don't you mouth off to me or I'm gonna slap you right in your penis. No offense <laughs> Mr. Herbert, but I'm a 17 year old girl and I don't need you here. Well, no offense to you, Meg, but you're a 17-year-old girl, and I don't need you here. <laughs> Y'all know what day it is? No. It's bath day. Oh, I don't want to take a bath. <laughs> Not for you, silly. It's bath day for me. But I can't wash myself. 
know anybody with a pair of strong young hands to help me in and out oh of the tub? Oh, my God. Oh, rats. Oh, very poor for them. <laughs> Thanks for buying me dinner, Mr. Herbert. Oh, I wanted to thank you properly for all your hard work. Souvenir photograph? Hell yes. Oh, he's in love. <laughs> oh my God, he wore a big fur this grass. Oh he loves. God. Their kids. <laughs> oh my god, they they also have kids. Fucking dream. Sad for her, but same. I shouldn't. But <laughs> but same. You didn't know I've always got my family looking out for me. Oh, hey, Chris, this is Tyler. Don't make this weird now. Oh, what a gentleman! <laughs> oh, oh. He's making him jealous. You pushed me. Boys, boys, we can settle this like reasonable and sexy teenagers. Whoever can swallow the most Tylenol PM wins. Oh my god. All right, raise some hell. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. You fucking pervert. Now he's also taking. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Well, Jesse, I guess we've got to find some other way to spend our evenings. And now back to ESPN's exclusive coverage of the Little League World Series. Oh, jackpot. Little and League World Series. cost me my job. Mine too. Superstore USA has their own paper route. <laughs> <laughs> that new paper boy done gone and broke my sternum. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> The dog and the owner are both the same. Oh, Stewie is the paper boy. Oh, gosh, gosh, but gosh, it's a brand new paper boy. It's a mighty full sack you're carrying. Piss off, you perverted old freak. Woo! Oh, we gotta fight. That's the reason why I love Stewie. Oh my god, I think Herbert is the most, most biggest pervert I have ever seen in my whole life. Literally, he is crazy for the Chris. And for me, the most funniest part was when Chris took his shirt off and literally Herbert was, you know, staring at him like, a, literally like he will eat uh, him. But, uh, but uh, he fall out from the stairs. So that was the most funniest part for me. And literally also when Stewie, 
you know uh, basically gave the newspaper to him and uh, he said that uh, he said that oh the new uh, new boy here for the newspaper for giving the newspaper and stewie replied him uh, very angrily so yeah that's the reason why i love stewie he uh, he always you know uh, speaks everything on the face but on the other side chris was like uh, i uh, basically chris was you know uh, bitching about him on the back side so uh, i that's the difference between the chris and the stewie seriously dad was that part was very funny when he was imagining that he married with uh, chris and he was imagining their children that part was very funny for me and yeah i literally enjoyed the whole video and seriously it is uh, herbert is the most you know weirdest and creepiest character in the family guys. but that is also down to like chris being so dumb like he went to like live with mr herbert who can do that yeah. and that first night was very very fun to watch like they both had their bed separate and then herbert was closing it down closing it down coming down 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 he was coming very very close and at that time only chris farted and that fart saved him otherwise what would have happened and i think so like herbert would have done a lot of bad things to chris and Chris was always like only that one point of time when he just gave away the newspaper at first and when Herbert was flirting with him at that point of time he at last he said oh he's, he's so weird so that was the only time I saw Chris realizing that okay he's a pervert and also the other time when he was like are you a pedophile so that was the only two times that Chris realized what Herbert is trying to do other than that he was always like okay Mr. Herbert bye Mr. Herbert so he was always a nice guy to Mr. Herbert he could never understand that Herbert's, Herbert was a serious pedophile and he could do anything but that joke was a very dark joke where he was like all the kids were playing in his uh, lawn and he was like oh here comes the pervert just get into my closet or like secret room and that secret room where he just puts in kids so that is very 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 weird from mr herbert but he, that is how he makes fun out of all these characters so it was very interesting to watch how do you guys find this video do let us know in the comment section below so do like share and subscribe Bye. Bye.